All right, people, welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem 4. Let's go on to the next chapter. Verdane has fallen to Grand Vale. On orders from Belhalla, Sigurd governs the region from Evan's castle with his newly wed light. <laughs> and his newly wed wife, Deirdre, ever at his side. However, Granvale's actions in Verdane are ill-received by the neighbor neighboring Augustria. The Lords of Augustria lead a storm of heated rhetoric denouncing Granvale. To make matters worse, the renowned pacifistic Augustrian ruler King Imka has been slain by an unknown hand. Imka's successor to the Augustrian crown is his firstborn son, Prince Chagall. Even as the, Augustrians Christ, uh, the Augustrian crisis unfolds, the bulk of Granvale's army remains in Isaac. And so Chagall has given the lords his first command as their new king. Invade Verdane. Invade Verdane. I don't know why I wasn't working there. As sole defender of Granvale's front, Sigurd once again finds himself in battle. Yeah. Chapter 2 Crisis in Augustria. Rakesis, I'm leaving for Augustria. I can't rest until I've convinced King Chagall to end this foolish warmongering. Please don't do it, brother. You know as well as I that Chagall murdered his father himself. You'll only be endangering yourself for a lost cause. He won't listen to you. You mustn't say such things about your king. I, too, have heard rumors of Ching Chagall's involvement, but they are just that. Rumors. There remains no evidence against him. Surely his majesty will see reason in this matter if I simply persuade him. But enough. I'll be I'll leave the three of my finest knights here to defend Noidon, should the worst come to pass. Kessis, you needn't look so sad. I will be back, I promise. I'm not about to abandon you in death. Killed again, brother! Yeah! Please, your majesty, reconsider your militant ambitions. Your father before you worked so hard to build an era of peace with Grand Vale. A war will only bring ruin to our people, bringing disgrace upon your good name for generations to come. I implore you, do not start a war. Ah, so it is you, Eldigan of Noidon. You dastard! My father adored you and you n used his trust to undercut me at every turn. But now my father is no more. And long live the king of all Augustria! For years you've made me play the fool, and now I will reward you in your kind. Gods, throw this man in the dungeon! Wait, your majesty, please. Pfft. Good riddance, the eye So Send my orders to uh, Bordeaux. Bord Bordeaux. Bord Bordeaux. Bordeaux. And Herrhein seize Noidon Castle. Once that nuisance is dealt with, we're clear to throw all we've got at Granvale. Your majesty, King Chagall. I see you made your decision at last. Manfroy? Yes, just as we agreed, father is dead by my hand. There is no turning back now. Even so, I still don't know if we stand a chance. Remember, Grand Vale still adheres to that tawdry old peace treaty with you, and their entire army is distracted in Isaac. 
Strike now and you could not possibly fail. You're right, the downfall of Grand Vale will mark the rise of the Augustri uh, of Augustria as Jug draws new leading power. Chagall, Emperor of the World. I like the sound of that. <laughs> we can only hope your ambition will be rewarded. Oop, now that we got that problem out the way. Milady, we've received word that Lord Elegant was arrested in Augustry. What? You must be joking. Oh, why didn't I try harder? I shouldn't have let him go. That isn't our only problem, Milady. With Lord Elegant gone, we need to be aware of Herr Hines' movements. Knowing of his lordship's absence, a strike from them is inevitable. After the Verdain incident, they're most likely out for revenge on us, especially Lord Elliot. Ugh, that Elliot. I can't believe how many times I've had to tell him I'm not interested in him. Smug, self-absorbed swine like him are the absolute worst. They're only... <laughs> oh my Christ, that's so... that's so bad. You can't be into your brother. Like, that's actually not okay, but... You know, if only more men were from were cut from the same cloth as LD. It's too bad they aren't. Else, perhaps someone would stand a chance to marry me. Perhaps. Er, be that as it may, Lord Elegant's Cross Knights are still dispatched to the northern, to the north at Fort Silvale. Well away from here. We three are all who remain. Noidon is vulnerable and they know it. Rest assured my brothers and I will do all we can to defend the castle but the odds are against us. I'm sorry, milady. Very well. Thank you, Yees. Ye ye Yeeves? 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 It's probably, it's probably like Yeeves. Uh, but please, look after yourselves. Don't waste your lives for me. Be sure to tell Eva and Alva that I'm sorry for all this. We are not worthy of such kind words, milady. Even so, Lord Elegant Hand picked us to defend you. Our Lord gave us a task, and we will see it through. As paladins of Noidon, our lives are yours, no matter what. To our dining breaths, we will live to defend you. Oh, Lord Elliot. Oh, gross. They look the same. They, they look like they're literally the same sprite. So let me get this straight. Eldigan ticked off the king and got himself a little prison time for his troubles. <laughs> That's perfect. Elliot, lay siege to Noidon at once. Let's see some tears roll down Elegant's cheeks. With pleasure, father. Are we still talking? Uh... Sire, we have trouble. It appears that Lord Elegant has been taken prisoner and Noidon is under attack. I bear a message from Lady Rakesis pleading for aid. What? They've taken Eldigan? Why? Why in the world would they treat a man so esteemed this way? Inform everyone to make ready. We ride for Noidon at once. No matter the cost, Rakesis needs us. He might never admit it, but Rakesis has always been dear to Eldigan. The loss of Rakesis would gravely wound him. My lord, you're preparing for another battle, aren't you? I'm sorry, Deirdre. I owe so much to Helvigan, I could never abandon his sister at a time like this. I thought as much. I'm not about to stop you. No, I will accompany you. What? No, I cannot allow that. I refuse to endanger you like this. My lord, do you not remember our vows? You swore never to leave my side and... And I... I am uneasy. I have a feeling that if you and I were to part, we may never find each other again. Please grant me this. Let me stay by your side. I'm sorry. You're right. 
I did promise. Very well, let us ride together. But you mustn't leave my side. I won't. Charm, ooh, 10% boost to hit and avoid. Miracle Sword. Paladins, she's got paladins. They're decent. Bruh, 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 bruh. They're all the same sprites. No, oh my lord, they're all the same sprite. They have all the same weapons. Well, I guess I guess that's the point. He said they're brothers, but like, Elliot has silver lance and hairline breeze. Return band. A barrier ring. Ooh, this is dangerous. I guess we need to hurry up to Rakesis' side, like. Like, we can't afford to not do that. So yeah, Deirdre, Deirdre's back. She's back. I'm super sick that she died thanks to Azel, but like... You can talk to Ethelin, right? So yeah, Ethelin gets the... Get, gets... I can't remember what Ethelin gets. Yeah, it's Deirdre, Deirdre, and Ethelin. Wait, hold up, hold up. How much money? How much money are we talking? Deuce, Deuce packing cash. Deuce packing cash. She can hook someone up. Sigurd doesn't need anything but his his sword, to be honest. And he definitely needs to sell that magic ring. I would have really, really appreciated if... I would have really super duperly appreciated if, um... If... Damn it, I can't think. If Azel had gotten that magic ring. In fact, I think he could probably buy it. No, he can't. Unless... Where's Do? And now, do is broke. But Azel, Azel can now. I think this is sort of worth it. Cause now Azel will hit like a truck. I can go into the armory by the thunder. Let me see, a steel blade? Who can use that? That's super useful now. Whoops! And let's have some fun. Let's send, let's send Deirdre into the arena. This should be pretty funny. Oh yeah, man, she's dead. She dead, yo. Oh yeah, she dead, yo. She's so lucky she dodged that. Who's next to kill her? Or well... She 
Oof. Well, lucky, lucky. Deer just got lucky, lucky. I think light magic has is effective against uh everything else, but I'm not too sure. All I know is deer just getting super lucky. I'm kind of glad for that, actually. Oof, now she's dead. Now she's dead. Yep. Unless she unless she dodges 88%, which could be a which could happen. Oh my lord. Now I know they're playing with me, man. Or wait. Could it be the circlet? Strength? You leveled strength. You have 10% in that. You're actually insane. You're actually you're actually high. You didn't level magic, but you you leveled oh, you're so sick, Deirdre. Could it be because of the circlet? Is she invincible? She's gonna lose. She lo she lost. She lost. Oh, that's not the right thing. I want to see if they they ain't got no healer heal staffs. <sighs> Ethelin and her. Oh man. So we need to rescue Rakesis as fast as we can. How are you faring so far, Deirdre? I know my brother is worried something fierce about you risking your life like this. Ethlyn, thank you for asking, but I'm doing just fine for now. Everything will be alright, I can feel it, so as long as I am as uh, so long as I am at Sigurd's side, our happiness will see us through. I don't think I've ever seen Sigurd as happy as he's been since meeting you. He's practically a changed man. Ethelyn, here, I'd like you to have this. I've been meaning to give it to you for a while now. Oh, is this a light brand? Wow, these are so rare and hard to come by. Are you sure you want to give me this? Of course, I know it will serve you well. I can't thank you enough, dear Jor, I'll always treasure it. La 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 light brand. Now you can attack. At range with this sword, it's a pretty good sword. I can exclaim. I don't think anyone else is going in the arena. Because the princess of Noidon needs to be rescued right now. Right now. All right, let's, let's let's head him up and move him out, gang. I need all my horses. My horses getting ready to get stunted. Yeah, Aiden can heal up Deirdre. I'm fine with that. You heal up Deirdre. HP, strength, speed, luck. What's up with all my healers wanting to be bodybuilders? Like, did you really need that? Did you really need to level up strength? 
You're not a bodybuilder. Lady Recrestus of Noidon, huh? I've been looking forward to this. She's been playing cruel games with my heart for years. But look how the tables have turned. I have an entire army behind me against her insignificant guard. What she could she possibly do? <sighs> She's powerless to resist coming back to Herhein with me. And who knows, perhaps one day she'll admit she wants it. You're a sick bastard. And your units move so slow. Our task is to perform a uh, is to form a defensive line. Do not let the enemy lower you from your post. Stand your ground, understood? Boop, boop, boop. So Herr Hines finally made their move. Perfect. Release the brigands on the villages as we arranged. Under the old king, you couldn't even dare to meddle in any of his property. Yet, it's the easiest thing to cheat Chagall. Strip everything of worth you find and bring it back here. I leave no one stone unturned. Let's release the brains on the villages. Her hide is going for Noidon's throat. <laughs> Who do I side with here? Let's wait and see how this unfolds. Instruct the men to remain where they are until the dust settles. Wow. The lords of Augustria are all dickheads. Can't say I didn't expect that. Alright guys, we need to... We need to start moving. We gotta get on. We gotta start getting, getting. Cause if we don't make it there before they do, cause they're already like right there. We're in for some trouble. We've got trouble. And I don't want trouble. So gang, let's, let's get a move on. And hey, look at that, Deirdre. You you uh you got left by Sigurd. Sigurd left you. I mean, can't say I didn't expect that, but like, ooh, burn. He kind of left you hanging. Ooh, let's not forget about Dew. Though he's gonna have a rough time, you know, getting getting his bearings. This is boring, but those paladins at least will deal with all of them. The only one that's really truly dangerous at this moment is uh, Elliot, and even then, I feel like we could send Lex at him, and he could die. Like Lex, Lex, Lex could probably go, go and eat him alive. Let's let's just be real here. But screw it. We need we need Rakesses. We need to recruit Rakesses as soon as possible. So the faster we recruit Rakesses is the sooner the problem go away. Like, uh, I'm sure those paladins can hold themselves. The, the paladin brothers can hold themselves until... until we arrive in one turn. Honestly, after we save Rakesis, I'm just, I'm just probably gonna go into the arena. Cause I feel like it's actually worth it. It's 
See, cause look, we're right there. Lex can, Lex can eat them all alive. Goodbye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold off, hold them off, paladins. You all got this. Let's see where Elliot goes. No, oh, you're so boring. So Lex with his Brave Axe can probably make short work of most of these guys. So bam, bam. Yeah, hit points and strength. Nothing I didn't expect. Because Lex is pretty predictable. Okay, uh, Kwame Brown. Oh, nope, I'm not sending him against this axe knight. I was about to send Kwame Brown in there to hit this axe knight up, and I thought it would have been a smart thing to do, but it's not. It's not a smart thing to do. Are you guys mostly Lance Knights? Most of them are Lance Knights and Axe Knights. Uh, I can send my Sword Boys in. I can send them in the tank stuff. And then have, like, Ethlyn as a background cover. I could even send Kwame Brown in for... Yeah, I could probably send Kwame Brown in too, have it in the background. Ethlyn, Ethlyn's gonna have to play a healer, because the other guys aren't gonna catch up anytime soon. Or well, they'll catch up in a turn, but not fast enough. So let's go see what happens. Oh, you're so slow. Oh man. Let's hope Yves doesn't die. Okay, now that I know that problem's been dealt with, let's go in. Let's go in. Actually, yeah, most of these guys are taken care of. Besides Elliot. But Elliot will just come to me, like... screened it. I didn't even mean to do that. <sighs> Look, computer. Look, if you keep doing this, I'm gonna scrap you. Like, I really will. Stop it. So where were we? Uh, Sigurd, you can take out this dude. How would you pick this up for me? I'm okay with that. Just wham bam, thank you, ma'am. Kwame. No, 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 nope. Finn hasn't gotten any action. 
He didn't get any action last part either. So let's let's have him seven, you know, and put in this work. Mm, check that out. Lex can. Lex can go in and attack Elliot. I wonder how much damage he can do with his Brave Axe. Ooh, so he does 18 damage. Elliot hits just a bit harder. But that's fine. All we need is for Lex to have his Brave Axe. And like that, he really sh can't do much. We start forming like a wall around him, the wall of units. He should stop being able to hit up any of our guys. Wait, hold up. Do you have just the Silver Lance? Yeah, it's just the Sliver Lance. Madeir can pick up this kill. Does anyone need healing? No? Likes should be fine. Alright, so Lex... Lex could potentially be our MVP for taking out Elliot. Or, well, he can do damage and then I can give the Lance to, like... I can give it to Finn. Cause Finn... Finn is the best candidate to get that. Because I don't think Kwame needs it. Let's just see what happens. Ooh, he did damage to Elliot. What's Elliot gonna do? No! Hold up. Is he going? He's running. He's running, no! Why, why are you running? Why are you running? Why are you running? <laughs> Silly fool. But this is all I really wanted to do. I wanted to secure this castle. So let's talk to Rakesis and end the part. Sir Sigurd, thank goodness you're here. Things were looking so bleak for a moment. Glad to see you safe, Rakesis. What about Eldigan? Is he still being held? Yes, he's still in Augustria. As if all the lords of Augustria have turned on us. Please, Sir Sigurd, lend us your might. No matter what it takes, my brother must be saved. Of course, I've no fondness for bringing war to foreign lands. But in this case, we've little choice. His Majesty King Asmer is aware of King Imka's assassination and Chagall's hand in it. He's received word of Chagall's ambitions to engage Gra invade Granville itself, and has already approved military action. His Majesty also believes Eldigan's rescue to be vital for to put an end to hostilities. Rest assured, Rakesis, I swear I'll save Eldigan. Yay! Now we have Rakesis. And she can heal, which is pretty bitchin'. And we can't touch this guy. Oh, I'm so upset. I just want, I want to hit him.
I want to hit it. I want his silver lance. But you know what? That's fine. We just need to. We just need to get ourselves into position. Get the ladies into position. <laughs> ladies, get into formation. Hey, ladies, get into formation. Maybe you should have someone go into the uh, arena. Like, I'll probably send Azel in there. Shoot, I shouldn't have Azel next to... Oh lord, they're going after Elliot? Pussy, like he ran, running away. So hold up, before before I end the episode, we gotta send Azel into the arena. And I've heard good things about Rikestis, like how broken she is. So I will make sure, without a doubt, that I will level Rikestis the heck up as fast as I can. I didn't mean to do that to you, Azel. I'll uh, send Ira. I, I need to end this episode, but I, I just need someone to get through the gauntlet. And I know Ira's probably strong enough to get through the entire gauntlet. Honestly, if she can get past the Lance Knight, we win. Uh, if she can get past Lovin, we win. Proc Astra. Yes! Yes, that's perfect. Now she can probably get through the rest of the gauntlet. Skill, speed, defense. Oof. Is he faster? Nope. Ira is queen. Oh my god, Ira. Oh my god, Ira. Oh my god. Okay. An armor lance. That's no good. You can hit. Oh, we win. No, we don't. 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 Ira. Ira. Mm -hmm. I keep doing that. Um. Okay. So let's have Aiden heal you up. Wrong guy. You know what? It's whatever. So I'm ending the episode here. I hope you people enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.